Hey everyone, welcome to Front of the Apps, I'm Menti, and this is episode 106 of the Battleship Brawl Season 5 Tournament. Uh, before we introduce the, the combatants today, uh, the polls are now closed on the Monochromatic versus the Effingham, and the Monochromatic has taken the victory with a score of 98-2. to So it will be replacing the Effingham in the uh, the bracket. It'll be taking the, uh, the Effingham seed, but uh, for today's battle, whoops, We've got the Spirit of an Era by Drew challenging the Jaeger Harlequin by Borderwise. Let's go ahead and get the camera in position. We'll get this battle underway. Jaeger getting off some early volleys. Spirit of an Era going to get out from under him. Ooh. Oh. Well, if they hadn't detonated prematurely, I think those would have would have connected. And then the Jaeger's rapid firing APS gun playing into the, the uh, spirit. So far, very close after the, the first couple of volleys. Neither ship really takes much in the way of damage. Ooh, Jaeger taking some hits to the bow there. Not too terrible. Ooh, Jaeger losing a barrel to one of its one of its guns there. And another barrel goes down. A yeah, Jaeger down to 93%, Spirit of an Era 96.5. Looks like the Spirit has lost one of its main guns in the back here. down to 85%. Oh, one of his main guns fell off. And she's listing heavily. Ooh, that front turret is a direct hit. And it has been completely disabled. The APS gun is still clink clinking away, but it just doesn't it doesn't do the damage that it needs to do. Ooh, uh, several more barrels on the Jaeger getting taken out by that volley. Yeah, well that gun is certainly landing shot after shot after shot. I mean, it'll do a little bit more damage with the uh, the belt armor stripped away, and it can get at those more squishy internal bits. But for the most part, that APS gun really doesn't do a whole lot. taking a serious hit to the stern there. Down to 68.3% health with two minutes left in the round. It's going to be difficult for the Jaeger to survive the remaining 
time. Especially with how low, yep, yep, there's the 80% sinking. I was just about to say, especially with how low she's getting in the water. Oh, that is the end of round one spirit of an arrow pulling a 92.6 percent hp victory all right here we go round two underway Jaeger with that big initial volley. Oh, those look solid. But they detonated amongst the rigging. It did basically nothing. Oh, now see that, this shell that detonated underneath. Yeah, see, that can get dangerous if you do that enough times, but... Jaeger really suffers from... Oh, excuse me. Yaw Ugh, gone out of nowhere. Sorry about that. Uh, the Jaeger really suffers from some... ...using issues. See, like, a bunch of those shells just detonated, like, in this hole, rather than penetrating it, hitting that wall, knocking out the engine with the explosion. So far, his scores again pretty even. Pretty even. Oh, Jaeger just lost a big chunk of HP though. What happened? Oh, she's lean into the right, real bad. Penetration through the uh, air superstructure there, doing basically no damage. Jaeger is kind of low in the water already, though. Spirit at 91.2. I mean, it's still pretty close. in there right in here did some work Ooh, direct hit on the spirits gun there to get all but one barrel is disabled 
disabled. And we're just about to cross the three minute mark in this battle. The HPs are pretty close. Behind, but Spirit is just kind of struggling to put out any damage at this point. Like it's basically this front turret and then like one barrel on the turret right behind it. Everything else is done. And I think the Spirit's HP will start falling a lot more quickly once it runs out of materials, which it's getting close. listing quite heavily as it tends to do oh the APS gun may have been damaged or it might have run out of ammo I think we got 30 seconds left in this round looks like both ships are gonna make it to the end oh, unless the Jaeger 80% sinks Oh, so close, but that's uh, no cigar for the Jaeger. It has sunk. An 86.3 for the Spirit and another big old goose egg for the Jaeger. It almost, it almost survived that one. <laughs> but almost only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. Go ahead, get the camera in position, and round three underway. Oh, Jaeger's not firing immediately this time. Those look like they could hit the st to the stern. Oh, just over. They still detonated way up in the air. Like, even if those had been on target, they would have detonated so high up as to do nothing. Big hole on the side of the spirit here. Granted, it looks like this is not a very heavily reinforced area. It's a, uh, you know, kind of an outer part space armor, basically. lag spike here. Oh, the, the, uh, the APS gun on the Jaeger went out. It detonated. 
Got a penetration straight to the thickest part of the belt. Even. probably was is the shaped barrels, you know, dropped to minimum, the size of minimum gauge because they were no longer connected as they fell away. Uh, wow! That's a really flimsy turret to die to that, but... Ooh, the bow of the Jaeger getting blown wide open. sinking Jaeger again already. Fastest sinking of the Jaeger yet. Oh, well, it managed to pull it back up. But that does not bode well. Oh, yeah, I think she's done now. I don't think she's coming back up from this one. And... Let that shell hit. And that is it. This match is over. The 92.6 for the Spirit. And another goose egg for the Jaeger. Which means there is absolutely no possible way for the uh, for the Jaeger to win via vote. So there won't even be one. Because this is kind of a waste of time. So yeah, so far all of the challengers have, been, have uh, won their matches against their challengee, the person they're challenging, which, I mean, given you get to choose, pick and choose who you're fighting, it's not terribly surprising, but thanks for watching, folks. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you on the battlefield.